the SKG AL3 controller and the scope of delivery. The main controller in the plastic box. Plugs and operation manual. The machine room lightning. The lockable main switch. The stop switch for the shaft pit or serving height. Cable fixings. The safety wiring loom leading to the shaft doors. The bus cable leading to the push button stations. The switch holding brackets with magnet sensors for the lifts with more than two stops. The push button stations. The door locks with counterparts. The final limit switches for lift with two stops. Installation order. At first, the controller needs to be mounted on a suitable place in the machine room. It is to be attached to the profiles by using the clamp plates. Then the lockable main switch is to be fixed with clamp plates also. The main switch is a motor protection switch too, which needs to be set to rated current. If there is restricted space, it can be installed on the machine supporter as well, but it must be reachable without any obstruction. Afterwards, the technician starts cabling with, for example, safety line W7 for the landing doors. Already fixed connectors can be released with a delivered clip. The cable must be inserted into the casing and the connector must be installed and set to plug X08 as shown in the wiring diagrams. The stop switch, cable W3, needs to be connected to plug X07. The motor cable W1, cores 1, 2, 3, have to be connected on X02 by a 5-pole connector. Cores 4 and 5 have to be connected to X04 by a 2-pole connector. The plug connector X06 will be connected to the first slot of the neutral conductor. The PE conductor will be connected to the remaining four slots. The colored power supply of the main switch needs to be connected to X01. Please note, one slot must be left free between each phase on the 5-pole connector for the three-phase current of motor and power supply.
The bus cable is a grey flat cable which leads to the push button stations. Please ensure that this cable is not getting damaged during the installation. For example, sharp edges can damage the bus cable easily. The 10 pole connector will be connected to X11. This connector must not be damaged or removed. Damages are causing malfunctions of the sensitive electronics. The controller box needs to be closed for further mechanical works to protect the sensitive electronics from dust and humidity. The machine room lightning needs to be mounted on a suitable place, preferably on the upper set to the controller to ensure a sufficient lightning during maintenance works. Assembly of the shaft installation. The holding brackets for the magnet sensors needs to be installed vertically on an opposite position to the magnets on the cabin. Using measuring instruments is helpful and ensures an exact justification. The magnet sensors needs to be installed by means of sliding nuts with the cable guidance in down direction and with the red spot on the sensors showing to the top. Please ensure a safe installation of the cables in the corner profiles to prevent any damages. For subsequent adjustments, a sling will be left down the sensor. Lead the sensor cable and the bus cable out of the push button box. Installation of the door locks and the door switches. The door lock is to be installed on the predetermined place on the door frame. The counterpart with the contact roller is to be fixed on the upper door panel. The locking position is to be checked and corrected by the length adjustment of the door ropes if necessary. The connection of the safety line needs to be made. Installation of the stop switch in the shaft pit or serving height. The stop switch needs to be installed on a suitable position in the pit, respectively in the serving height. Installation of the push button stations. The push button stations are adjusted by the factory for the relevant floor. The marking on the back side shows the level where the push button station needs to be installed. 1A belongs to the lowest floor. The bus cable is to be connected as well as the magnet sensor to X01. Please ensure that only on the bus cable ending the blue bridge on the printed circuit board is closed. It needs to be open on all other push button stations. Otherwise malfunctions can occur. The push button station is to be installed in the opening in the door frame and it needs to be ensured that the cable cannot get damaged. <laughs> 